Welcome back to the Keg King Channel Brewers. I'm Daniel. Um, today we're going to be checking out the Sputnik, which is a bench top pouring system to cool your beers when you already have a system that's already packed full of taps and you also want to be able to add a couple of extra kegs without having to take any kegs off. This is an excellent option. It comes in a one and a two tap version. We're going to check out the two tap version today. And also, I want to show you a couple of other kegs that we've been coming up with here. The 20 liter versions, A-type coupled, some with a bag, some without. You're going to dig this. Check it out. So the Sputnik is a really simple plug and play solution to getting an extra couple of kegs on tap if you have a bar that's already all kitted out. It's simple because you just plug it right into a 10 amp socket, just like you would any other appliance. It doesn't need any special requirements for power. It also works really fast. So these kegs have been sitting out for like a day and now we're able to just like move the beer from them with, in this case, on the silver keg, CO2 pressure. And in this case, just the air pressure that the compressor inside the Sputnik can put on the bag inside this keg. So we don't have to worry about there being air spoilage in this one because that bag is actually airtight and the beverage inside of it is carbonated and ready to go. So it will move from here through the cooling system and out the taps at whatever temperature you set this dial to. Now there's a little magic going on out the back of the system and I'll show you that as well. So this is the back of the Sputnik uh, where you hook everything into. Your beer lines are gonna be going into these two push fittings here. They're quarter inch, so they take the uh, 6.3 by 9.5 millimeter OD uh, beer line. In this case, we have the Lupulus line as well as our uh, quarter inch Everfresh line going into these ports here. This is the power adapter um, in the back of it. So this is where the power lead comes from. This switch here, if you see here, this green on and off switch is for the air compressor. You can just run it and it will run the air into a bagged keg to compress it. And if you just leave it on, it will top up that air every time it notices that there's a drop in pressure. Also, uh, this is the air out. So this is the line coming from the compressor to the bagged keg. And that's the back of the Sputnik. Very simple design, really easy to set up and use. So while we're talking about the Sputnik, let me tell you what's behind the Sputnik feeding the beer to this system. These are those new kegs that we've been talking about for quite some time. This is the solid 20 liter keg. It's a really great keg, light proof with the kind of PET mixture that we use for this uh, assembly. And also uh, the clearer one, which is basically a junior, but with a PRV set in that place where you usually put the bung in the junior. This is a special type of PRV that's on both kegs that makes these kegs better than any other PET keg that's out there. They're safer because of this PRV. But more importantly, this one has a bag in it. What does that bag mean? Well, it means that you can get your beverage into this fully carbonated, ready to go, and now you can dispense with this one with air, which is exactly what we're doing today with the Sputnik by using the compressor that's in the Sputnik to put pressure on the outside of the bag here by way of just a normal A-type coupler. So both of these have been speared for A-type, but both kegs, any of these kegs, are available in A-type or D-type. You can also get Bullock and uh, floating dip tubes for them and use them just like juniors if you wanted to. But they are gonna work with everybody's existing bar systems. You don't need to buy a special coupler for them. One of the great things about these kegs is that they're pressure tested to five bar. And you have a PRV in place like this, they're much safer to ship around. Other versions of kegs like this that do exist on the market out there don't have a built-in PRV. Right, so in this case, this keg, which has a uh, light proof uh, protection on it, is also just hooked up to a normal CO2 gas from a cylinder. We've got that set just a little bit above 15 PSI. You can go a bit higher with these systems because they do need a bit of extra pressure to get them through all the line that's inside here, all the track inside here that's being refrigerated with refrigerant um, 290. So right now, the Sputnik is actually using its air pump to put pressure into this bag keg. Um, what I wanted to show you is I've actually put a splitter onto the line out from the Sputnik's pump to show what the pressure is in this gauge. So we're gonna go ahead and shut off the pump about right there because we don't need any more pressure. 
it's just a simple pour. Really easy to use. That keg's sitting out at room temperature, but it's hitting this glass nice and cold and perfect. So that's our Sputnik systems. One tap, two tap will be available. We are gonna be upgrading them so that they'll have king lock fittings that will be able to work exactly like this with any other tap besides those UBC taps. Plus, that's our 20 liter keg systems. The, uh, the bagged version, the, uh, the other type with the gray exterior that you're just gonna be able to fill. They can be A type or D type, whatever you want. Um, we like them, we know you're gonna dig them too. So check them out brewers, they'll be available soon. The Sputniks already are. Thanks for watching. And thanks Brendan for the beer. Mm -hmm.